two, uh, how come two songs and different tuning on this album? Because you were saying, well, all songs are in drop D. No, two songs were in different tuning. There are uh, things my father said because of the piano. piano yeah. That one, we uh, it's in just standard 440 pitch. And like I would, I did like a Keith Richards style part. No, that one's in drop D. I played it in drop D. Damn it, I played everything in drop D. Actually, let me look at this list real quick. Drop D, open, drop D, drop D, drop D, drop D. Literally every song on our record is in drop D, except for Sunrise. Because the, the Jimi Hendrix kind of part at the front of that, I played that in standard pitch, a full step flat. Oh, boy, I'm glad you did that. But, that, that, <laughs> that, that, that whole, but that's the only song that I tuned to standard on. Because, like, Blind Man is just C sharp. Please Come In is the one I was telling you that's, it's uh, open E, a, a step and a half flat. So it's C sharp, but it's open E. Yeah. I don't know how to explain it, really. And then uh, Reverend Wrinkles in C. Soul Creek is like that open G variation. To where, like, with open G, you tune down, um, shit, I can't remember. But you tune, like, all the strings to the open G. All we did was tune our A string down to a, from G to F. So it's C, F, C, F, A, D. But how do you decide when you write the songs? How do you, how do you decide then? That's what we write. Like, we'll just, like, well, like, with the long sleeves, the chorus in that, the melody was too high for me playing it in C. So we took it down a half step to B. And I could sing the chorus a lot fuller and like a full voice to where it's thick and not really thin. But like, like with Please Come In, that one was just messing around with the open tuning one day at the practice house and we came up with the intro lick on that. Soul Creek was the same thing, just goofing off, tuning one string down to see if you can come up with anything cool. It's the same with Devil's Queen. Um, but everything else on the record, it's just like drop D is kind of like the standard thing for us. Which it gets boring is why we do the open tuning and stuff, but we, I mean with drop D it's just kind of like there's a rubberiness when you're playing that just makes stuff feel really good, and the reason a lot of our songs are tuned down to C sharp or lower is because I have a baritone voice anyways, and it's easier for me to sing like the higher stuff when we're tuned down yeah. to C sharp or a full step below that to B. So whatever compliments your voice or, or compliments the song yeah. the best. Yeah. And um, was it uh, for you? Was it um, well special to do the to, to to do the piano song? I mean, it's different from the first album. I think it's more. Yeah, that that song, man. Things my father said is uh, it kind of hit home with us, man. I mean, luckily for us, the four of us, our dads are still all living. But um, we had two friends that lost their dads within the last couple years. How come accidents? Or uh, one of them was. Uh, the guy had cancer, and the other one was just an accident. And, um, you know, it's it's a shame, man, when you watch someone that's like a brother to you and they lose their father who was like an uncle to you. It's 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 some tough stuff to deal with, man. And, you know, it's we remember what it felt like for us, but we couldn't imagine what it felt like for them. So it's kind of like we wrote that song, and it started out, something totally different but turned into that because of our friends and thinking about them along with the stuff I mean we wrote that song at the practice house we wrote like the music at the practice house and the lyrics in the studio was one of the last songs you wrote and then Devil's Queen was written in the studio so it's just kind of like but things my father said with the piano it's kind of like we felt like we could take that step on this record because the first record we showed the world who we are and now that we've been around the world a couple of times, we felt like we could explore ourselves a little more and show the world what else we have to offer. You know what I mean? That way we're not making the same record twice.